Runners and walkers are hitting the pavement this morning for the 12th annual Homeboy Industries 5K Run and Walk. And KTLA is a proud sponsor of the event. And joining us live, making an appearance on the KTLA Morning News. We're excited about this. Frank Buckley and Vera Jimenez, two of our favorite people in the world. How's it going, hey guys? guys? We are having a great time. Vera can't hear you, but they just asked, how's it going? It's going fantastic. The weather is great. It's not too hot. And more importantly, we were on the stage with Father G. Father G, Father Gregory Boyle, Homeboy Industries, they are transforming lives and communities. And that's why I'm here. You know, I had him on Frank Buckley interviews a couple of yeah. years ago, and it fundamentally changed my view of gangs and gang members. And so I thought if there's anything I can do to support, and this is one thing we can do to support, right. to bring attention to the cause. Right. Uh, Frank, you know what you just said about it changed your view of gangs. I realized how impactful his work and the work that the homeboys and homegirls do here, how impactful it is and how important it is. One day I was walking down the street and there was this guy covered in tattoos and normally I would get a little like stiff, but all of a sudden I thought, what if that guy is from Homeboy Industries? He still has the tattoos, but it doesn't mean that he's necessarily like an active gang member. So it changed the way that I saw the world. And a thumbs up to you, buddy. I changed the way I saw the world, and I hope that it changes the way the world sees people that were in gangs. Yeah, Father Greg told me that he is in not all of what they carry right. but how they carry it right. right so we all have something and the gang members the former gang members that father greg works with that homeboy industry is working to transform they're not just getting at the the stuff on the surface they're getting deep and what is the trauma that caused all of it mm -hmm. and and by dealing with that you can deal with the deeper issues Absolutely. so having said all that we got 4,500 people here today. Yes, they're, and they're all walking, and we're all walking and running to support the cause. And if you're not familiar with Homeboy Industries or the work that Father G has, go on Amazon, go online, find his books. His books are inspirational. Trust me, they will change your life. Yes. You guys, Extravagant tenderness is what he calls it. Yes, you guys, yes I, go ahead. What I'm loving, what I'm seeing behind you guys is all these families doing this together. You're seeing a lot of communities and families coming yes. together. It's a family event. Oh, it's absolutely a family event. Like we said, this is the, the largest turnout they've ever had for this 5K. They've been doing it for 12 years, 4,500 people this year. Last year, they had 3,100. Every year, it is growing. People are catching on. This is a, a, a movement that is, it, you know, this is not just a talking point. This yeah. is something that I truly believe in. This is an organization that transforms people and communities. And, you know, we can all say, oh, those gang members, they're causing problems. Yes. There are problems associated and violence associated with gang life. But what are we going to do about it? This is an organization that's doing something about it, and that works. It works. It, it works. It works. And you know what else they do? They bring in doctors that volunteer every day to remove tattoos. And the priority is gang tattoos, because if you walk in with a gang tattoo at a place and try to get a job, guess what? It's not going to happen. And they know that. So that's a huge priority is removing those tattoos. And one of the statistics is that they remove a thousand tattoos. They work to remove it because, again, it's a process, but they work to remove a thousand tattoos a month, all through volunteer doctors that donate time. Um, one thing that Vera and I learned today was Father Greg said, hey, Father Greg said, the higher the sock, the more down the vato. <laughs> and check out. Hey, but look at your socks. I know. I should have pulled my down. <laughs> we, 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 forgot, we forgot to pull up our tube socks. I, I left those in the car. You so. know what, Frank? You just made Frank, my we're day. Just not that cool. The day that Frank Buckley says we're not that down. Yeah. Yeah, when, when Frank Buckley says vato. vato, that's pretty good. All right, Vato. We'll see you later. Thank you. Lynette's, uh, Lynette. Lynette's roasting me right now. <laughs> go, go, Lynette. Go. So we'll funny. see you later. Hey, Thanks for joining us this morning, guys. Bye, Do it again you. soon. You guys are awesome. <laughs>